Hello and welcome. It's Jilly Cube and I'm here on the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia. Coming to you with a little pour just with some leftover paints I have left. I know this is only a 20 by 25 canvas. I've just wiped it off. I've left the bit of colour there. It's no problem. I'm just going to do a... Actually, I should do a little spin. Let's have a spin. I haven't had it. I haven't had a spin for a while. Well, this spin, let me see. Let's move that. I haven't had a spin. That spin. Oh, well, that spin better. Oh, that's probably a little bit better. Why not? Let's see what I can do to make it stay on that um, spinner. So I'm just going to have a, a quick spin. I'm finishing up my day in my art room and I have a few uh, trial colours that left and I'm just going to bring you along for the ride and see what I've come up with. And then I can explain about my trial colours if they turn out. So I'm going to just... That's just the ordinary masking tape. So as you see, I just did a circle-y and then I just want something that will help it, there you go, stay on my spinnery thing longer. Perfect. I need to grab a pair of gloves. I'll use a pair that I've already been using. No problems. So yeah, I'm in crazy art lab mode today and I've been just testing things. Some things have worked and some haven't. That's the way that's the way it goes sometimes, isn't it? So I am going to just spread pour on this paint that's been already um, mixed. So the pouring medium and my is in the drop down box and also I think I have a video there of the um, making up of the paint so this is the fluoro green as i said they're just colors that i have left over so i'm going to use them up fluoro green i might add a little bit of the viridian green in there and i may add some of the black Um, really go to town on this and add fluoro blue. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Crazy lady. And then fluoro pink. These are all um, global colours, by the way. And then I'll finish off with black on it. Okay, let me have my little, um, this is my Amsterdam white mixed with Floetrol only and I'm going to put it on my little spatula if I can find my little tiny chubby one. Where's it gone? Here we go. This is just the little spatula so I'm gonna, oh it'd be good if you took the lid off Jilly. Yeah, crazy art mode day today, so I'm gonna Yeah <laughs> I'm gonna try and pop it on the spatula. Oops. See what I get. Oh, look at those cells. Wowzers. Trousers. It's a little bit more. So just put it on the spatula itself. That I think. Oh, I've taken the nice cells off there now.
let me try swiping it with a little um, piece of card maybe let's try this little piece of card here um, try it on there this time if I can get anything better with that one Okay, not anything particularly super duper. Let's give it a spin, see what we get. Let's go back the other way. No, not. There's some nice things happening in there, but nothing actually you beaut super duper what's going on what's going on there's me bit of card you got now me bit of cards got soaked in all the other colors let's see if i can create something come on you beauty what's going on here normally sells up straight away but it's not happening today it may be that base paint that I'm using is not doing anything for it. Hmm, interesting. Actually, like that uh, fluoro green and the viridian together. So, but not. I think adding that other brown did not help it look at that <gasps> those colors beautiful together the viridian viviriridian I actually love doing this and playing with this kind of creates like a 3D effect through your artwork. It's very relaxing, but certainly love that Viridian green in there. Let's see where I can mess up with this. I quite like that. It is having some little um, champagne cells happening in here. Let's put the heat on it, see what we get. Oh, I'm going to bring the camera down, let you have a look at those. That's really interesting. Oh, there you go. Look at this interesting the colour mix in there and this viridian green, even though there's no cells, that's it's just gorgeous, soft. Look at that, looks as though you're going down into a hole. It's like a whole 3D effect going on. Sorry, I'm getting the reflection on my lights but they look like little gems in there that's gorgeous yeah it's always good to have a little bit of an art lab day where you just yeah test out stuff look at that i know some people said it reminds me of snakes don't do those but i can see an octopus eye in there can you see it Alrighty, I am done with this. I might try a bit more with that Viridian Green and Fluoro Green together because they seem to be going really nicely together. Obviously with the dark grey or black would be nice. Okay, thank you guys for joining me again on my crazy little art journey. But until tomorrow, there will be another one. Alright, take care. Bye for now.